Good morning. Um, there's a, a digital analyst, Brian Solis, who says uh, it takes uh, six minutes nowadays before getting a tech distraction. So instead of the eight minutes allocated to me, I'm going to try to stay below the six minutes. And my competitor here is your phone. Um, and uh, actually, by, by just saying this, I've set the framework of why we are here today. Um, I, I want my audience today, the people I'm talking to are really the banks. Uh, why are we talking so much about entrepreneurship, about investing? Why now? Why not five years ago? I mean, the internet has been here for years now. I, I think it's, uh, I thought at least, it's a fair question. Um, and uh, I wanted to share with you my enthusiasm for um, entrepreneurship today and entrepreneurship in the region and why Lebanon and, and why this broader Arab region. Um, so the, uh, the revolution, because I think we can definitely call it a, a revolution, uh, happens today because I think the internet pe penetration has reached critical mass and is multiplied by how many devices we're using the internet on. And um, as a day job, uh, I'm a fund manager, an equity fund manager. I've been doing this for the past 13 years. Um, at a much later stage, but what the type of animals I see coming are companies that did not exist 18 months ago and that are now uh, very profitable and make billions just because they have been empowered by this internet revolution. And then as a night job, uh, the MIT Enterprise Forum with uh, Salam Yamout here, we've been trying to help entrepreneurs uh, in the Arab region for the past seven years through the um, MIT Arab Startup Competition, receiving uh, 5,000 applications every year for the past three years now. And Lebanon has always been about 15% of that very big pool. So the, the first thing we can do um, as, um, as ecosystem is really uh, look at look at our market, which is the Arab market, and the Lebanese will need to reinvent themselves as Arabs today, and uh, maybe as global citizens, because the, uh, the internet penetration in our region is one of the fastest growing. Lebanon has just jumped about uh, 15 points, thanks to uh, Minister Sahnawi, in terms of uh, internet usage. The uh, smartphone con uh, penetration is the highest in the world in some of the Arab countries. We are a young uh, population, which means we adopt technology quite quickly. And uh, the good thing about youth and uh, education is that if you've noticed, um, embracing the internet and technology does not need much education. It's quite uh, native in most of uh, the old and the young. Uh, so which means the opportunity is quite big. So the, the first point I, I wanted to um, to emphasize was that the opportunity is big uh, in the Arab region uh, for Lebanese entrepreneurs, and uh, they have a say in Arab entrepreneurship. The second thing I wanted to say is that we've been talking a lot about money and 400 million. Um, well, I mean, that's great, but uh, you know, as this uh, very popular song goes, it's not about the money, money. We need a lot of uh, help for these entrepreneurs. It's, um, we've been mentoring as MIT Enterprise Forum, lots of entrepreneurs that uh, a lot of them are here today. Visibility is another issue that we need to solve and Minister Sahnawi talked about this. We took a lot of the uh, uh, Lebanese entrepreneurs that are here today to Le Web uh, in, in Paris and we caught quite a lot of uh, attention in terms of media attention but also uh, customer attention to these uh, companies um, and maybe they can share their thoughts uh, on this. So uh, I hope part of this money will be also spent on uh, building a proper ecosystem, not necessarily for profit, but to mentor and, and help those entrepreneurs. I engage also the banks that are here to, to offer them um, uh, help, uh, also giving them some of their time. So, and the third point is, um, We've been talking a lot about ICT and the technology sector. This is definitely, uh, I mean, a huge opportunity to invest. But within the um, uh, MIT Arab Startup Competition, we receive about 30% to 40% of the application in healthcare 
and energy, uh, which are powered by ICT. So if you put software into energy and software into healthcare, uh, you get also a lot of technology and investment opportunity. And finally, um, because um, I saw cardiodiagnostic here, a global, yeah, a global FDA approved medical device out of nowhere else than Tripoli. Uh, so I think we can, we can also try and think out of the box and see opportunities not just in the greater Beirut, Beirut area, but uh, we have a responsibility to go and get them also elsewhere. And they are there, a global FDA-approved company from, uh, from Tripoli. Um, so we, we've been running uh, with Salam, the MIT um, Enterprise Forum for the past uh, seven years, seeing Lebanon always as a stable 15% share of the Arab region in terms of entrepreneurs. So I hope that with uh, this initiative and all the goodwill that's around this table, we'll see it grow even uh, to a bigger number. That's it. Thank you. <laughs>